Hello, and welcome to Avio's Journey. My name is Anthony Pika. This show is all about helping the new and upcoming voiceover artists grow their business and sidestep all the crazy things that I seem to step on. I've got an awesome video for you today. I'm going to be showing you how to change a regular MP3 file or a WAV file in Adobe Audition to a ULaw file or MuLaw file as it's supposed to be called and you would change uh, to this file for example if a client requests it for uh, some sort of uh, telephone message it is a uh, decrease in the file but it is used still today in North America and Japan and if you ever asked for an A-Law file I'll show you that too that's used in Europe and like I said this is primarily uh, primarily used for voice messaging and IVR however I don't recommend you changing your file unless you are asked Okay, let's dive into it right here. All right, uh, that's not the right scene. Here we go. So you can see here I've got my screen, and what we're going to do is I've got my recording. All you need to do is you need to come up here, and you need to go to Save As, all right? And you are going to go to Format. When you go to Format, you're going to go to the Lipston file, okay? And you are going to click that. Then you're going to go to sample type, okay, and we're going to change that to 8,000. That is typically the sample rate, all right? And here you can already see that it's saved that way, but it won't be that way when you do it. So what we're going to do is you come into this next, and you're going to hit this drop down. Most likely yours will be in the 64-bit range, but you see there's the U law or the mu law right here. And there's also the A law right here. Okay, so again, mu law is usually North America, Japan, A law is primarily in Europe. Okay, so you can click either one, but you click on mu law, all right, and you hit OK. Okay, now at this point, if I hit save, it will save this file, all right, how it is. Now, if I come back here, I'm going to hit cancel. So you can hear how the file sounds. I just recorded this before I started. All right, so here we to go. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is nobler <laughs> in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune. A little Shakespeare there for you. But let's go ahead and now show you what it will sound like if uh, we save it as a MULA file. All right, here we go. So again, we go to Format. We go to Lipston File. Click on that, we go to sample type, change that to 8,000 hertz. Then we're gonna go ahead to the format setting, change that to the mule law, okay, and hit okay. Then I'm gonna hit okay, all right? And basically, it will save that. And now take a listen. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune. As you can tell, it now sounds like you're listening to a phone message. <laughs> All right, that's how you change to a Mu Law. And uh, like I said before, all you have to do to change it to an A Law file, if you're in Europe, is click this button right here, hit OK. All right, change that. And to be or not to be, that is the, the question. question. You are off to the races. All right, everybody. Well, listen, I hope that helped out. Uh, let's go back here. I know this was a quick and easy file, but I know whenever I'm looking for things and and uh, people had brought this up. It was clear that there wasn't actually a lot of tutorials out there on how to do this on Adobe Audition. So thank you so much for watching. Take a moment to like, subscribe, share this video, and you have a wonderful Monday. I will see you soon. Goodbye.